Good morning, my dear friends. Praise the Lord wherever you are. It's a beautiful morning and a beautiful day. I do believe you are well. I do believe God is keeping you safe and that the Lord is covering you wherever you are. This month, you're talking about revival, my dear friends. We are talking about revival. And then, my dear friends, I'm talking about this. Angels when we don't expect. Angels when we don't expect. Today, I'm believing God that wherever you are, whatever you're doing, that God positions an angel you don't expect. It doesn't matter the status or the caliber of the person, but God positions someone for you who can be able to do the bidding of God for you and just bless you in your point of need. I read from 1 Samuel 30, 11, it says, Now they find, found an Egyptian in the field and brought him to David and gave him bread and he ate and they provided him water to, to drink and he drank. They gave him a piece of fig cake and two clusters of raisins and he ate. And the Bible says, and he, then his spirit was revived, for he had not eaten for days. This an Egyptian who was starving and was brought unto David, and David was able to feed him to revive him. Today we are praying for angels where we don't expect. But in the name of Jesus, may God put someone somewhere for you where you don't expect. May there be an angel to position, may God position an angel in, in your life to do something divine and powerful for you. That in the name of Jesus, you will see something unique, something, uh, you see, uh, uh, you'll see that blessing, you'll see that lifting hand, you know, you'll find that shoulder that you need, you'll find that bridge that, that you need through an angel that God has put in your path that you did not expect. Just like this Egyptian, a king was the path that God put in, in place. Today we are telling God, wherever that bridge is, wherever that angel is, we are trusting God to bring them to our lives because we are at a place where we need some level of help and Father ordain and appoint the right angel. Like this Egyptian man, David was appointed to be his angel. May the Lord appoint an angel for you why you don't expect today. Let us pray. I bless you and I worship you, Father. I lift and I glorify you. Thank you, Father, for what you do in our lives. I pray to you in the name of Jesus. May Lord release your angels. Position your angels, Lord, left, right, and center. Put them in the right place, Almighty Father, for your children today. May they get angels where they don't expect for the glory of your name. In the mighty, powerful name of Jesus, bring thanksgiving. Amen. May angels stand before you. May you find the help you need today, even from unexpected sources. Amen. Stay blessed.